it looks like every election cycle there's always characters that make the whole month run and you know stale and boring process to give it some injection of some levity and and frivolity and it just makes for uh, a relaxing time now here these girls from the brother decided to uh, collaborate with Ron Paul. Now, Ron Paul's character don't seem to be jiving with uh, these kind of ladies, however. They probably voluntarily decided to get some recognition on the side, and so they came out and uh, supported him. In fact, uh, they even, it seems, uh, stormed or some other stormed a place where some Christians were having a caucus meeting to determine who they'll vote for. Um, Ron Paul and his uh, son have some unusual ideas, some new ideas, I think, and um, the population are taking them serious. So that um, maybe the times are different, perhaps people are wrong, but uh, he can get his message open when folks don't agree with him, um, by and large. So uh, he's just become a French candidate. Um, he hasn't won any of the um, caucuses. So the toss-up is between Santorium, um, Mitt Romney, and with Gingrich, mm -hmm. who have all won caucuses. But hey, Mr. Ron Paul, uh, I mean, you're a fascinating character. You add some drama and some some dynamism and some new uh, fun to the whole election process. And I wish you the best of health and long life so we could, you know, continue having you inject your ideas. Perhaps one day people will agree with you, but right now, um, they're choosing others, and uh, don't give up. You just keep on going, man. Go to the end of the race, and um, Godspeed, and, 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 and may you have a, a great life, Mr. Ron Paul.